Hi, welcome to Ramesh Soft Video Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we will talk about in how many ways we can perform data typing actions. That is, in how many ways we can enter the data into the text field in Selenium. So, we can enter the data by using web element interface method we are having right now. What is that method? Send keys method. So, this is very frequently we are going to use it. In sometimes some cases, this method is not going to be work out, right? So, what is the alternative for this, right? So, in total, five ways we can perform data typing actions in Java. That is, we can enter data into the text field. One using one method is using send keys method of web element interface, and second one is using JavaScript executor. JavaScript executor using using execute script method using execute script method and third approach is uh, by using actions class third approach is by using actions class and fourth approach is using robot class even by using robot class also we can enter data that is we can perform data being actions even one more way is there in javascript executor itself other alternative that is we'll see that is the fifth approach now let's see here so in selenium we can perform data typing actions in five ways that is we can enter data into the text field in five ways one is send keys method of web element interface execute script method of web javascript executor interface one is um, send keys method of uh, actions class method and by using robot class and by using ro javascript executor let's see one by one we'll see now create one class selenium now i'm giving class name as a send keys test now let me write the main method now web driver driver z equal to new firefox driver now let me enter the url driver dot get off i'm entering here some damn dummy one https colon www dot gmail dot com now let me identify the element driver dot find element by id i want to find the element by id so get a id of that element now open gmail gmail.com so right click new click on inspect element now what is the id is having identifier id yes now this method is going to identify the element and returns to that element in the form of web element so watch my previous more elaborately i explained what is that find element method and in detail now so on this element i want to perform red being action so dot send the keys method which is there as a part of web element interface soft dot selenium now see here so if i trigger this program now what is going to happen right click run as java application so here i'm using the send keys method to perform a redeeming action so this send keys method is from web element interface yes now see here this is one way so using send keys method of web element right so this is one approach this is one approach let me comment out it now see other approaches now second approach by using actions class now see here let me see a second approach with actions class so create term actions which is from org.openq.selenium in coming videos i explained in detail what is actions class and the constructors mechanism in actions class and all the methods in the actions class so, actions so let me pass here driver now actions 
this actions class is having one method called click so here i am passing username click on that username and then enter send keys on that now i am entering i am entering ramesh soft dot selenium at gmail.com gmail.com now see here let me run this program somewhere i am getting what is it yes now we know that whenever we are doing actions class whenever we are using actions class methods compulsory we should write build dot perform build dot perform now see here right click run as java application now this approach using actions class now see the output what is going to happen Yes, now it's trying to open Gmail page and it's rendered or not from a soft dot name at gmail.com. So this is second approach by using actions class and uh, third approach using JavaScript executor, right? Now see here JavaScript is an JavaScript executor is an interface. Now in the next videos, I explained JavaScript executor in detail. Okay. So what is the order the methods are there in JavaScript executor? What is the use of the JavaScript executor in detail it is there? Now see here. So driver. Now I am converting driver to JavaScript executor. Now JavaScript executor. Now JS. Now see here what I am doing. So I am using third approach JavaScript executor. So we are having one method called execute script see here this method is taking how many parameters two parameters one is string parameter one more is where are the parameter that is object so first compulsory first parameter we need to pass string when it comes to second parameter if you want you can pass zero parameters one parameter two three any number right so where are the method so if you want what is about if you need some information about where are watch my java videos they explain in detail what is the method so i am passing so now see here execute script here what i'm doing just after here arguments arguments of zero dot value i want to enter onto this is value some data i want to enter it ramesh soft ramesh soft i want to enter some value this value you need to enclose with a single quote single quote and then write uh, which element you want to enter it username now just run this program now now see here this is by using javascript executor right click run as java application Now see here, is it under Ramesh Soft or not? Yes. Now we saw with the web element interface and we saw with JavaScript executor. Now we saw with actions class and we saw with actions class. Now we'll see with the robot class. Now see here with key press and key key release events uh, that we can implement this send keys mechanism. See here, I created robot class object and then on that robot class i am writing key press so i am eventing i am performing one key event what is that r i am entering r and then i am releasing that key press so once it is done, again i am pressing a and then i am performing key event a and i am entering the data called a and releasing it again key press i am entering the event called m e s h now see here right click run as java application now see here what happens Now see here, is it entering Ramesh or not? Yes. So this is one approach. So in coming videos, I explained about robot class in detail. So just here I'm explaining the ways to perform data typing actions, right? Now this is the fourth approach. And fifth approach, so without using find elements method, so even we can identify the element with JavaScript executor. Now see here, so I think already JavaScript executor is there. So just a little. 
So get JavaScript executor object and then on that call execute script. So now here see here what I am doing. Now I am identifying the element with the document dot get element by id id here i am writing my id is identifier id identifier id now now on this uh, i want to send the value z equal to in single code write it i am writing ramesh soft dot selenium soft dot selenium and give the semicolon now see here so this is where i write is always optional second one so if you want you can pass or else not required now see here if i run this program what is output i'm going to get so data typing action is going to perform on this element now see here right click run as java application so even by using this is one approach without using find element or method also we can do it now see here ramesh of dot selenium is entered or not yes so here am i using any find element method no even i am identifying the element by using what document of what java script executor so in total five ways we can perform data typing actions in selenium so the most commonly used one generally everyone is going to use send keys method but sometimes in real time it may not our application may not uh, support with this send keys sometimes send keys method will not work out so that's time we have all these alternatives so we can perform data typing actions in selenium in five ways by using send keys method of web element interface by using execute script of javascript executor by using actions class by using robot class and by using javascript executor so thanks for watching the video have a good day thank you so much